Hello, Pauline. Welcome to Mr. Jacob's Gym Class. And hello to everybody else. Welcome back to Mr. Jacob's Gym Class. Well, today I have a fantastic workout. It's called To The Max by my son, Max. And we're going to take you to the max. All right, let's get started. Okay, so today's workout is a little bit of a slow down workout. It's not going to be as speedy as the other workouts that we've done. As you can see here, we're going to have nine different exercises. And the way that it's going to work is you're, for each of the nine exercises, you're going to have 45 seconds to do as many reps as you can for each exercise. Now during that 45 seconds, if you do get tired, feel free to stop, get your breath back, and go right back into it. After 45 seconds, then we're gonna have a 15 second break. And during that 15 second break, you can get some water, get yourself ready for the next exercise. Now, as you can see here, our exercises, our nine exercises, um, are gonna be for squats. So you can do regular body squats, you can do squats with weights or squat presses. Then we're going to go move on to lunges. That's going to be your second exercise. Push-ups. That's our third exercise. I know a lot of people have a uh, difficulty, but remember, you can always modify on your knees, um, or 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 you can do a uh, straight up uh, push-up. Then we're going to go to up-down planks. Again, you can modify that with a regular plank. Um, then we're going to move down to shoulder taps, which is an extension of the, the the plank. So that's going to be a little bit tough on the core. Then we're going to move on to deadlifts. I'll show you what that's about when we get to it. Bicep curl, tippy toes, and then we're gonna end off our workout with dips. So for the dips, I am gonna need a chair. So if you have a chair handy, please bring it along. Um, so for today's workout, you're gonna need a chair, gonna need some weights if you want, or, or, or some jar, something that's weighted, something that's gonna um, make it work a little bit harder. And then obviously always some water, always gotta keep hydrated. Okay, so let's get started. 45 seconds of squats, here we go. So I'm just gonna use regular body squats. As you can see here so remember your, your feet are about shoulder width apart the same as your shoulder and you're pretending like you're gonna be sitting down and then you're gonna kind of stand up pretend you're sitting down and kind of step up so now I'm gonna modify again remember 45 seconds you can take a break if you want I'm gonna modify doing my squats with my weights as well and there we go and now, you know what I'm actually gonna use a press as well so remember, you can always modify up, modify it down. Okay, five more seconds. So that's 45 seconds almost. There we go, now we take our break and get ourselves ready for lunges. So lunges I'm gonna do long way, this way here. What I'm gonna do, you can always do lunges where you step forward lunge, or you can do step back. I'm gonna start my, with my step forward. Here we go, 45 seconds. There we go. So again, this isn't a fast-paced workout. This is nice and nice and controlled. I know what some people like to do is they use this moment to stretch their arms up in the air. Oh, that feels nice. There we go. Okay. So during my 45 seconds, I am modifying as you can see. Oh, looks like we have a special guest today. Hey Stanley. Or he wants to get in on the workout too. Okay, so my last little bit I'm actually going to do with weights. There we go. Oh, we only have three more seconds. So I'll just do a couple of reps with the weights. There we go. And now it's our 15 second rest. Awesome. There we go. So the next one is our push ups. Again, it's 45 seconds, but do as many as you can. Always take a break. Here we go. Three, two, one. And there we go. Nice and low, there we go. There we go, take a break if you need it. Stretch yourself out, and then go back to it. There we go, with 30 more seconds. Awesome, here we go. Remember, you can always modify on your knees. I'm gonna do my last 15 seconds on my knees as well. There we go, that feels nice. Okay, five more seconds. And last one, there we go. All right, awesome. So let's get some water, let's see what's next on the list. Okay, oh, up, down, plank. So it looks like some of our middle stuff is kind of core heavy. All right, here we go. And let's start it. There we go. So this one is our up, down, plank. So it goes like this. So down, down, up. I like to alternate my 
my arms I'm going up with and down with. There we go. I can take a little break here. Okay, that feels nice. Here we go. I'm going to continue. I've got about 15 seconds left, I think. There we go. Five more seconds. And stop. Okay. So if you want, you can stretch it out. There we go. Okay. Now I'm staying down here because I know our next exercise is a shoulder tap. So for five more seconds, and then onto our shoulder taps. Like I said before, my son Max, he came up with this workout. He was really excited. That's why it's called To the Max. Modify this one a little bit. I'm going to do a regular plank on my elbows. So remember, when you're doing a plank, once you find your spot, try to get your elbows to meet your toes. So you're really pulling forward. Five more seconds. Here we go. And stop. Okay. So that's, those were our our shoulder taps. Now it's deadlifts. So this one, I am going to need weights. Um, if you don't have weights, you could use no weights at all. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna stand up tall and just watch me. I'm gonna go on my side. Here we go. I'm gonna go down and then up. So it's almost like a mini squat. And then straight up. So the key for this is try to keep it so you're not looking down because then you're really bending your, your back. You're curving your back. You're keeping your back nice and straight. So I like to always look up. There we go. There we go. 15 more seconds. You want to keep the weight or your hands really close to the front of your leg. Five more seconds. I'm going to do one more. There we go. Awesome. That felt nice. Okay. That was our deadlifts. If we look down, next is bicep curls. So again, this one you will need some kind of weight with five more seconds. So. I'm going to stand straight. Try to keep your elbows right in. Here we go. And curl all the way up and all the way down. Remember, your arm is just moving from your elbow down to your hands. So the upper part of your arm is just staying still. And just see how many you can do. Great job. Here we go. 15 more seconds. There we go. And then we have just two more exercises after this. So, like I said, this is a nice slow paced workout today. And stop. Okay, have your break. So, the next one is tippy toes. And I am actually going to use my weight for my tippy toes. So, what are you going to do is you're going to find a flat level somewhere in your, in your house, maybe where you're standing right now. And you're going to go up and down just on your tippy toes and try to keep a straight body all the way to the top. Here we go. 45 seconds. Up and down. This is really good for that little, little muscle on your lower leg called the calf. Your calf muscles. It's really good for that. Now, because it's a small muscle, it, uh, it does tend to burn kind of quickly. So I'm already feeling the burn. Okay, we have 15 more seconds and then we're, dead. we're at our last exercise coming up soon. Five more seconds. And stop, fantastic. Okay, so the last one is this and this one you're gonna need your chair. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna come, and make you a little bit closer. And you can have your hands, make sure that your, your chair is nice and nice and settled and your feet extended in front of you. You're going to come off and then you're going to bend your elbows, you're going to bring your body down and up. There we go. 
And I gotta tell you, if you wanna make it a little bit easier, you can put your feet in, that makes it a little bit easier. The further out you go, the tougher it gets. Now this is working on another little muscle in the arm called the tricep. There we go. Okay, 15 more seconds. All right, five more seconds. This is a tough one right now. And stop. Okay, well, you did it. You finished one whole level. You finished all nine exercises, nine minutes long, because nine exercises are about a minute each with the 45 seconds on, 15 seconds on. Now, if you want to do it once, that's awesome. That's a super level. You're awesome. Fantastic. If you do want to get to the sonic level, just go back to the beginning of the video. Do it again. That's two times. If you want to get to the supersonic level, you know what you need to do. Three times the video over, that gets you to supersonic level. And remember, let's try to do the workout three times this week. And I know I, I, I uploaded this video a little bit late, so, so maybe today, Tuesday, maybe Thursday and Saturday. You can, do, you can choose your dates. And remember, let's make fitness fun.